Hey guys, what's up and welcome back. Today is photo shoot day, which means I'm gonna go take pictures for Instagram and I decided to film you guys how I do my makeup, what I use for my face. Now, honestly, my skin's doing pretty freaking good, except this little area right over here, which I personally messed up, so don't mind that. So, on this video, for these pictures, I wanna go kinda like a more rocker-ish, old style, um, different style of eyeliner. So let's go ahead and start practicing first our eyeliner and then we'll do the rest of our face. So for practice of eyeliners, I do have a few and I've obviously, I'm like, I'm still looking for the best one out there to be honest. So for my Holy Grail is the NYX. I do have a hooded eye on this side more than this side. So it kind of doesn't go up my lid. So honestly, the NYX is like the bomb.com. So what I want to do is I kind of want to have like the whole cut crease of the wing liner but I, I, back then, I used to do the little sharp ones down here too. So I'm kind of thinking in that range that I want to do. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and line our eyes first. Just to kind of have like a graphic idea of what we're trying to do. And I know that I really want like a sharp line. So let's go ahead and just do this. And this. Okay. Mm, okay, so I think we got something going on. I mean, I can live with this. First thing is first, we're going to go ahead and apply our sunscreen because I already have a little bit going on. I didn't go work out, which sucks because I really don't want to work out. But, you know, I really want to take photo shoots too. So we're going to do the photo shoot first and then we'll do the workouts here at home. Hydrate our face. And I'm going to go ahead and use the Trulies. This one is the Glass Skin Finish. And I love how it leaves my face. It's not too oily. It's not too dry. But this one like hydrates your face pretty freaking good. For primer, I'm going to go ahead and use my um, Milk Primer. Just a little bit because a little bit goes a long way with this sucker. So for foundation, I am going to go ahead and use my Anastasia Beverly Hills one. Ooh, I hate it when the train comes in. We're gonna pour a pump. We just need one to be honest. And voila. Dab this everywhere. Right now. So we still have a little bit more of a darkness going on. This was actually a little bit more darker now. I don't I haven't been getting a tan lately, so so for concealer, I'm gonna go ahead and use the Morphe and the Elf Cosmetics. What is in my eyeball? What is in my eyeball? Okay. I'm gonna put that here. All right, going on this side. All right, now. Now we're going to go ahead and blend to the endless. Let's go ahead and blend this out to the max. We're going to go ahead and start adding powder and setting our face. So for the setting, I'm going to go ahead and use the Derma Blend, which is like one of my holy girls. I really do love it. If you guys are not used to Derma Blend, try it. Give give the little sample. It's life changing because we got makeup. All right. Now that we have that, we're gonna go ahead and bronze up, add blush and highlighter. Blush from Wet and Wild. I'm gonna go ahead and bronzer. Oof, we got some color back. All right, so now that we have that going on, we're gonna go ahead and do our brows and add some highlighter. I haven't messed with Becca in a very long time. So let's grab the Becca and let's see what we got from Becca. We're gonna go with this one, which I believe she is the... We're gonna go with Opal. Alright, very subtle. Alright, grab the moist beauty blender. I'm gonna go ahead and just press it. Press it. Press it. Just wherever you put the highlighter, nowhere else. Press it. Alright, so I'm gonna fix my eyebrows because they look funky. And we're gonna be back for the I the real finale and everything is done. We have a dilemma. What I wanted to do, I could not do, and 
Now I have to fix the wing liners because I did a gigantor wing. What happened is I tried playing with a new liner and you know, we should just stick with what we knew. So we're going to go ahead and fix this wing. So do you see how like this wing is like, it's sharp but it curves and this one's just sharp with no curve. So we're going to have to go ahead and curve this area a little bit. But I'm also going to go ahead and make my eyes look bigger which means... We're gonna mess around with eyeliner more. We're gonna leave it like that. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and make our eyes look hella large, like that. So we made a little line, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a fake eyelashes. What the? Playing around with a new toy. Oh hell no, when it flew, I think it damaged the tip because it left me like a big ass bulk there. This is this is definitely when you need like a sturdy eyeliner tip, which is not that one. All right, I think we're going to leave it like that. We're going to put on some eyelashes and eyeliner, and then I'll show you guys the final look. This was a mission. I don't know if we're going to do dark lipsticks. I think we are because I like dark lipstick. All right, guys, and this is our finishing look, and this is how we're going to take pictures. Wow, somehow I look really wild. Well, I look really light skin, but look. Don't we look like a badass? Especially since our hair is like kind of like dark gray green. Ooh, let's put on the jacket. Oh shit, don't it? I can't say. Alright, let's do this. Don't we look like bottles this now? Excuse a double chin. Do we see this? Do we do we do we see how glamorous the shots are gonna be? It's just like aesthetic. Yes. All right. So we're gonna go take the pictures. Put a little bit of red liner here, and then we're wearing the kiss lashes, which are like my new favorite ones. For the black lipstick, I'm wearing this one from Lime Crime, which is black velvet. And, um, yes, let's go take some pictures. Oh, hack. You see this? I fixed my eyebrows. Y'all want to know how? Stay tuned. I'm going to show you guys how I do it because they don't always come out like this. Let's go.